hi guys welcome back to my channel it's G from happiness and crafting so today I'm going to do just a little bit of mixed media it's just going to be a very quick sort of easy one now I've got some fabric which I was using in a previous video this week um, I think it was the roll for inspiration so I've got that on my desk which I thought I would use up I've got a few of my little um, embellishments here which I thought would go really well so it's just a really easy simple one today um, and I've got a little doily and I haven't used doilies for ages so I'm just going to do a quick background so let's just shake this one is buccaneer bronze so let's just have a quick little squirt of this to give us a background this is ground espresso so shall we have a spray I don't normally spray these do I and then I'm going to add a little bit of maple syrup bronze into that as well so just to get like a little nice little background now let's just use this brush these can just be brushed on nothing too exciting pop this over like that now I do like the way the color goes in you can see where it goes darker where I haven't popped the gesso on the page so let's pop that down just want a little background there we go mix of browns I'm just going to quickly dry that there we go lovely I might just actually what did I spray this one this was the dark one this was the ground espresso and I quite like that I don't normally spray because I just make a mess but I did like this let me just spritz that I'm going to quickly dry that it might be a bit too much water on there but let's just dry this okay just dab those bits off oh I quite like that the way the colour comes off there okay so let's just stick some of these on I'm going to let's just rip this I think let's just rip and stick rip and stick let's have a little bit of the matte medium I just want this to be a very very quick one because I don't have a huge amount of time today so let's just stick this down which way I quite like this way actually not that it really matters Put that on. it's more fabric I think I want on here stick some of these down what have we got in here I quite like that one. Oh, look shall we have a bit of these on here today got any numbers there we go a few of these little things let's just stick them down then I can go around it with a little bit of fabric Taking a bit of the paint off the back, but we can go through that again. I think. Let's just stick some of these on. lovely well, let's have a which way round does that go do you reckon that way a bit more glue there we go should I 
quite like the way the glue has taken off that paint. Do you think that's about it? What's this one? Should we have a number five? Let's put that on there. Lovely. That will do for now. Right, let me just quickly dry that. Perfect. Let's pop a little bit. Oops. This is a nice sort of brownie one, isn't it? This is the candied, oh no, a Canadian bacon blush. Let's put a little bit in here. It doesn't really show too much, does it? A little bit of this in there. got some new chalks as well which I'd quite like to use let me just quick dry that here I've got these chalks that I bought um, and they're chalk they're soft pastels which are these that I bought which are quite nice so I'm going to give those a go now these are the ones that I normally use which are the pebbles and I've, a lot of you have said that you can't get hold of them but I have seen them in um, Amazon Dot com so I know you can get them there and these but these are lovely they just blend so well so this is a nice one isn't it these blend with water as well which I love I'm loving the colors I'm loving these browns My little distress crayon which is a bit squashed on here let's pop a little bit of this on I haven't used this for a long time Lovely, show a little bit around here, blend that in, down in this corner. Lovely. Do like that, so that's a nice little base. Should we stick a little bit of fabric on here? Oh, if I can rip it, there we go. So I've got my, I believe, here we go. This is my thicker gel matte medium. I think this is the thicker one. So this will, this is a little bit better for sticking down some fabric. So I've got all this lovely stuff just to give a little bit of texture on here, I think. Would be quite nice, wouldn't it? Let's use the same brush as I've been using. Let's just make a big mess. Okay. Let's just stick this down. So this is a nice one because it is a lot thicker and it's great for heavier items and obviously fabric bits as well. So this is the Liquitex one, which is a great so we've got a little bit of this on there. Hello. 
Okay. Stick that down. Oh, I do like this one. This is a little bit different to normal, isn't it? Doesn't look as messy as I normally do. I think I'll just keep the fabrics to this side. Like that lovely bit of cheesecloth on there. Am I in the right place? Just go up a little bit. There we go. I do like that. Lovely. Do you think that's about it? A little bit of this? No, I think that's about right actually. I don't think I need any more than that. Let's put my lid on. Let's try a little bit more the brown. I might go just a tiny bit darker here. Oh, I do like these chalks. Now, where is my, here we go, is that it? Yes, yeah, my Stabilo. Let's just go around this a little bit, shall we? Lovely. Now this blends well, so I'm just going to put, I don't want it to be too dark, but that blends so nicely, these chalks, especially with my finger. I do have that little thingy here somewhere. My little thing. don't know what you would call it little clamp might work a little bit better than my grubby finger Gosh, I quite like this. Not much colour, but it's very effective, isn't it? I love it. Lovely. Right, we got like a grey. That's a nice little highlight, I think. This does, doesn't it? Lovely.
Oh, that's nice. There we go. So what do you think, guys? Do you think that's turned out quite nicely? Quite nice for a, a quick little one today, isn't it? It's probably a little bit more black down there, I think. Quick, simple, easy one. And I think that's turned out really, really nice. Nice sort of vintagey colours, isn't it? Nice vintage one. So there we go, guys. I'm going to leave it like that, I think. So I add a little bit of white to these bits. Just like that. That looks quite nice, doesn't it? I quite like that little strip down there. There we go. Love it. I'm going to leave that like that so I don't ruin it. So there we go guys. Nice, quick and easy one today. A um, little bit of fabric. Some of my um, embellishments which I have printed on to tea stain paper. We have a little doily. We have the lovely new chalks which I love. I use a little bit of the Distress Crayon and some of my lovely Lindy's um, inks as well, which I think that's given a really, really lovely background. So there we go, guys. Thank you so, so much for joining me. Please stay safe, take care, enjoy the rest of your day, and I will see you soon. All right, guys, bye-bye.